बढ़ते हुए लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन इट इज विद ग्रेट प्राइड दैट वी इंट्रोड्यूस यू टू द सन ऑफ आवर सॉइल मिस्टर हलीचरण नार्जरी हुज कंट्रीब्यूशन टू इंडियन फुटबॉल हैव बीन ट्रूली रिमार्केबल Mr Halicharan has been representing India on the international stage since 2011 please join me in welcoming Mr Halicharan Narzari as he delivers a motivational speech that is sure to inspire us all thank you angni gosagar bani pray dinai jungni bodolenao boyni kribu gajamsin duran khap jana thangasinna dongo आं बेखो बुंने सान जे जंगनी इन जेनेरेशन थी जोबर मजा दिन बड़लैंडी फुटबल बदायने को लाने फैदिबानी जंगनी गेलेगिरी दिशा जोबर गजनताजे गांवी रंगौकी गांवी स्किल गांवनी रंग को देखने बे दुरन कपनी मजा गले दिन बे दुरन कपनीफ्राइन मनसे क्लाब सेलेक्शन मन हाई आं दिन बेखो बुंग सान जो बड़लैंडी फुटबल बदायलैने जाबाई आं सारमीम बेखो रिकुस्ट कर जंगनी बड़लैंडी खेला लाबाई जहाते जंग इनि जेनेरेशन जिसबानी गेग्रा दो गांवी रंगौती को देखने मजा मजा गले और बेनी गुबुन दबसे मजा जैगर थाना गले आखो आशा खा दिन जो गले ना जोबर फुटबल गले तो आं लुबे जे जंगनी इन जंगनी जेनेरेशन गावा गावनी रंगौती को देखने जंगनीफ्राइन गाखना हाई आं बेखो दिन बुंग और बेबादी ने जंगनी बड़लैंडी फुटबल बदायलैने को लाबाई थे आं आशा खा गजन Thank you Mr Halicharan Narzari for your kind and encouraging words bithanga jiwao bebadi na augailang bai thana hatung jengi sarnao aros gabai gazantung I would now request Shrimati Nandita Garlosa cabinet minister government of Assam to kindly share her insights on the occasion of the trophy display and press conference of the 133rd edition of the Indian Oil Durand Cup 2024 Thank you respected my colleague UG Brahma Uh, Pramod Boro CEM, uh, Rangaura Nazari MP, Jayanta Basumatari MP of Lok Sabha, Katiram Boro Speaker of BTR, Lieutenant General R C Srikant, Major General Vishal Singh, Brigadier Akash Akshay Chandran, all the uh, dignitaries seated here as well as my dear students. It's been a wonderful occasion for me to be here back within a year for the unveiling of the Durand Cup. I still remember we came to Kokraja last year for the unveiling of the cup this year we are here again for the unveiling of the cup the basic idea to be at Kokraja is to have the youngsters down the line 10 years to be in the national football i am expect that from Kokraja or from BTR there will be players who will be playing in the indian team and with that motto we have come to Kokraja with the duran cup and i'm sure that they will be a successful one Without this, it will not be a successful event to start in Kokrajhar. Durand Cup had come to Assam for the last five years. We wanted to make it a big event, and had it had been a big event. But only the extravagance of the big event doesn't satisfy. It has to satisfy to the ultimate, and the ultimate will be youngsters who are here from this very region has to be in the playground for the Indian team. and for that reason each and every student seated here or anybody who ever will be listening to this program has to have that in mind that one day we will be able to conquer this very motto of uh, 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 the speaker who had just spoken in front of me had give, must have given you the inspirational speech of how he had faced when he wanted and how he had gone through playing is uh, or a sport is a very discipline you make a person of a very discipline and i am very sure that all the sports lovers are usually if we are speaking of a sam down the line if you see there were many sports stars who were from this very region there were areas there were regions there were times 
when we had to be down, when we had not been forward. And I was very sure even if Pramod Boro's CEM would not have spoken, I was thinking in my mind that I will be speaking that very sentence that he had spoken. Once upon a time, the armies were here to look at the uh, extremism and now today it has come out for this post. And it is very well said because I also belong to those area which was a disturbed area. So, youngsters, you must have not seen the disturbed in the areas in the last 20 years. We had seen the disturbed areas and then now we have come to a peace. And when we had come to a peace, sports is such an event that it can take up to a very bigger dimension. And to, and to keep that in frame, the Honorable Chief Minister had taken up sports in Assam as a very, as a very event uh, in terms of a Khel Maharan, where you will be expecting the Khel Maharan will also be happening this year, which will be announced very soon by the Honorable Chief Minister. But at the same time, it was very surprising to us that when we started Khel Maharan in the entire region of Assam, there were somewhere around 49 lakhs of individuals who has registered for the sports under 19, as well as above 19, only for five disciplines. Imagine for the rest of the disciplines, how many individuals in Assam must be wanting to play. Keeping that in mind, the sports that have created in the event in Assam, be it in football, be it in Koko, be it in Kabaddi, be it in, uh, be it in volleyball, and be it in uh, your, uh, uh, the other uh, athletics. Those were the events that we have only just uh, given the opportunity for the youth of Assam to play. And, and in all those uh, uh, youths that we have found it from the regions of Assam, we, were really, uh, we, were really found, we had really found 612 number of individuals who had topped it. And to shape that 612 individuals, it is the responsibility of the government of Assam to look after them and to give them a new dimension in their own field, in their own scenario. Youngsters, you all are seated here very comfortably. Life is not comfortable as it looks like and as it is. But to make it more comfortable, the leaders are there for you to make it comfortable. And the Duran Cup is one such occasion. It is not only bringing football to you, it is bringing the other extravagance also. Try to capture it, try to get it. How Duran Cup, with, if, if a government is doing it, it's a very different thing. If a government is doing with some organization or some associations, it's again a different thing and it's a better thing. And you will find that Duran Cup is, is in its 133rd edition. It, is come, it has come to your area. Think of, the, think of it that 133 years it has taken to come to this place. And what a good opportunity it is for you to have it in after 133 years, take it down the line for the next 100 years, what it is going to make up. And I'm very sure I keep it very hard to myself that somebody or somewhere from the down the line has to be in India. Sometimes I used to think of myself, if only Northeastern sports individuals would have been in Indian football, maybe we would have, we would have clicked somewhere where we want to. I'm not blaming others, but, but that, that is a perception that I have it. Give a chance to the people of Northeast, and this Northeast has a huge opportunity. Only thing is that we had been, we had been a, a big gap of, a big gap I will say, or a widespread was there from mainland India, that is what I felt. But now that mainland India is coming towards your area, why don't grab it an opportunity? Taking it as a very auspicious occasion, where earlier when I had come it, it was not only a part of it, it was, it was only a part of it, Guwahati was here, and we had brought it in Kokrajan to be only a part. But now you think yourself it is not a part, but it is in Kokraja. So there's a very vast difference of how it was last year and how it is going to be this year. And may this continuation of 133rd Duran Cup be a very successful one beginning from the 30th. May youngsters be there from the next 10 years down the line. There we, we will try to see how many have come up in Duran or not also in Duran, in other, in other leagues or in the national area to be a part of yourself. Take this opportunity, I repeat it again and again. Don't just come to be in the program to hear a lecture. Take it something from here what you want to be. Come, coming from here as an audience, being a spectator is something for you to be it here. But when you go back from this room, take something from this room and make your life and make your career in the field of sports. Once again, I wish you all the best to all the people of Kokraja. Congratulations to the entire team for making it happen in 
Kokrajar and to make it a successful event down the line. Thank you very much for having me here. Thank you, Srimati Nandita Madam, for your valuable speech and encouraging.